I've seen in other countries that there's so-called uh, consultation on draft reports, but by the time you get the email and downloaded the report, it's almost time to send in your comments. So obviously there needs to be a sufficient time for commenting. And then if you don't like the, the final uh, answer, you, you can appeal. And uh, around one third, historically, I think one third of all nice decisions have been appealed by, by somebody. And 50% of those appeals have been successful in some way. Uh, sometimes uh, uh, success is defined in terms of a small change in the decision, sometimes uh, a complete overturn of the decision. So uh, it, it's not something that's just being done uh, for the sake of it. Uh, there, are, there are things that have been overturned um, through appeal and involvement of stakeholders. And linked to that is this idea of transparency, which I've already mentioned. I, I think it's important to understand what criteria these agencies are using in their, their decision making uh, and the reasons for, their, for, for making a recommendation. Uh, NICE will always say why it's recommended something, whereas in some jurisdictions you just get the answer, you know, we don't want your drug, thank you very much. 